Hi, and welcome back to the sewing desk build. Uh, this video starts off with something a little different. I'm building a jig right now that will allow me to cut very thin strips of wood. Um, I do use uh, power tools to make my jigs just because it's, uh, it's easier. The uh, magnets in the wood keep the saw uh, flush against the piece and allow me to cut very, very thin strips. And you can see here I am cutting the strips that I will use to make my inlay. Uh, this is the first time that I've ever done inlay on a project, so I'm kind of excited to see how it will look. I'm using pieces of uh, hard maple as well as a South American hardwood uh, that is very, very dark. The uh, name escapes me right now. Uh, it's been four weeks since I started this build, and uh, everything is going well, except that the weather here in Japan has sucked. The uh, rainy season doesn't want to end, and it's been raining constantly uh, every day, so the amount of time that I've been able to be in the shop has been limited. Um, I did, however, uh, finish the inlay uh, on one piece, and I was able to finish the frame of the right side of the large half of the desk which you'll see at the end of this video. Um, I did make one mistake, unfortunately, uh, when I was about to attach the um, small uh, short apron on the side of the desk. Uh, I accidentally cut the wood, uh, forgetting that I had to leave a little bit on each end for the tenons. So, because I have a limited amount of cherry, I decided to use the piece that I had and just um, attach it with uh, pocket screws. Uh, I know it's not uh, traditional, um, but like I said, I didn't want to waste the wood. I didn't film any of that uh, because it's pretty standard stuff, using, just using a uh, pocket hole jig and screws. But you'll be able to catch a glimpse of it uh, when I assemble the uh, desk at the end. Everything else I think is pretty self-explanatory. Um, I appreciate you watching these videos, and if you're new to the channel, please subscribe and uh, click the notification button so that you can see when I upload a new video. Hopefully, I'll be back in another week uh, to show my progress. Thanks again, and uh, enjoy the rest of the video.